Hey guys, what's going on? My name is Josh Yuwa, and you guys are watching my YouTube channel. <laughs> I'm still trying to figure out the whole introduction thing. So today is going to be quite a, a serious video. I'm going to be talking about how I came out and, you know, how I did it and when I did it and stuff like that. So, let's get started. So before I tell you how I came out, I want to tell you a little bit about my parents. My parents are mostly Christian, you know, they're not very, very religious, but there's different aspects within them that, you know, I felt was very different and I kind of felt that they would be supportive, but also not supportive. Right now my mom is the only person from my parents that really knows that I'm gay. Um, I know my dad suspects it and I can tell he does because he says things to my sister and ugh, it's honestly scary. But when I came out as gay, I was in middle school. I think I was around seventh grade maybe. I didn't really come out then. I kind of figured out I was gay. I was always just realizing I was into guys and when I realized that I was like oh my god this is bad this is bad I can't be gay I just can't be gay and I lived with that until about a year ago 2014 ever since then it's been it's been a journey to be honest and I'm really at a loss for words for this because it's honestly a very touchy subject for me and it's kind of hard for me to talk about. Um, my dad doesn't know that I'm gay and neither does some of my other family like my grandmas and uncles and aunts and it's sometimes very hard for me. When I came out, I came out to my mom first and I actually texted her. I texted her and I said, Mom, I'm gay. And I, I said it and I was debating whether or not how I'm going to do it and how I'm going to tell her that her son her firstborn son is a homosexual who likes males and all of that. I was struggling. I was in this bed struggling to figure out how I could tell my mom I was gay. So I just, I just texted her and at first I think she thought it was a joke but then she realized I wasn't joking at all. She looked inside the text and she's like, I support you. Honestly, this has been a journey for me. Telling her that I was a homosexual was very scary for me because I didn't know what I was going to do. My heart was racing. It was it was racing so hard I, I didn't know how to feel. But after I told her that I was gay, it was like I was on top of the world. And for the next few weeks after that, I felt that I can do anything. You know, being gay isn't a bad thing either. So I said to myself, I'm happy I told her. The next day after I told my mom that I was gay, I went and I told my sister in person. I said, right downstairs, right in the basement area, I said to her, Ashley, I'm gay. And then I started crying. I cried right in front of her and she's like, cool. And it was, it was awesome. She was like, alright, I support you. And it was, it was breathtaking and I was just so utterly overwhelmed with the support my mom and my own sister gave me. You know, I didn't expect to get the support that I did because of their background and, you know, living with them, it was, it was so weird to see that they honestly did support me. But when I came out to both of them, I felt I was on top of the world. I felt I could do anything. It was like a weight was lifted off of my shoulders, off of my chest, and I could do anything. So, after that, I, I was so comfortable and I was just like on top of the world. At that time, I was dating someone and he told me, you know, come out when you feel you're ready to come out. And that was the greatest advice I could ever get. So, I'm going to tell you right now, make sure you have a support line before you ever come out. Make sure you know when you're going to come out to anyone, and make sure that 
you know, you're ready to do it. Don't do it when other people say to do it. Don't do it whenever you're uncomfortable to do it. Because you want to make sure you're happy to do it. And honestly, I can guarantee you it'll be a great weight lifted off of your shoulders after you tell someone. It honestly is. So, a few months after that, I told friends, I told family, and right now I consider myself openly gay. Even though my own father, my own grandma, and other people don't know about it. If they were to see this video right now, I would be in shock because they'd see this video and they'd say, Hey, Josh, we didn't know you were gay. And they would say something. They would... I honestly don't know how they would react. But I know for a fact that my family does have love for me regardless. So, if my family happens to be watching this video from, for some reason, hi, I'm doing a YouTube video, it's 10 p.m. and I really felt the need to say this on YouTube. I have a passion for YouTube and I have a passion for telling my story on the internet. I have a passion for producing content myself. I love it. I honestly do. Hey guys, thanks for watching. I know this video was very basically depressing, sad, and you know, touching almost in the same point. So when I was editing this video, I was honestly almost in tears and it was very sad to me. Um, make sure you guys comment, rate, and subscribe to make sure you are able to tell me how I can do my videos better in the future as well. If you guys didn't like some specific things that I do within my videos, please let me know down in the comments section down below. I'd love to be able to take your feedback into consideration for sure. Also, if you liked any of the other content on my channel, please let me know. And yeah, thanks for watching guys. I love you all. See ya.